there's a lot in store, uh, especially starting tomorrow with the impact weather, the wild ride, the metaphor of the roller coaster. I mean, it really encompasses it well. Tomorrow, uh, we're dealing with high fire danger, warm, windy conditions, and then in the evening, potential for severe weather, especially east of the Omaha metro, and then by the middle of the week, the wind's going to be a factor again, but uh, the drop in temperature, whew, it's going to be uh, quite apparent. Right now, we enjoy seeing the cloud cover move over Omaha. In the nighttime hours, the clouds act as like an insulator, allowing those temperatures to uh, be more steady. And right now, look at that, 43 degrees. A little southeast breeze, so even it feels like temperature right now, just 40 degrees. A little cooler where we had more clearing up north, where we've been under the clouds longer, mid to upper 40s down south, 46 in Lincoln, Beatrice, 50 in Falls City. A little bit more breezy, closer to the Kansas-Missouri borders, not too bad right now in Omaha. We'll see the winds pick up, though, by the end of the day, gusting more around 20, 25 miles per hour and more out of the northeast of that with the cloud cover. We'll limit our heating today, but still fairly seasonable for this time in early April. So here's Storm Predictor by lunchtime. We're around 50 degrees. There could be a spot shower the first half of the day, mainly south of the metro. Most of us are going to stay dry. Highs today with those clouds and that northeast breeze, likely in the mid to upper 50s for most of us. Continuing overnight, another mild start tomorrow, low to mid 40s. We'll see a warm front push through. Look what happens. Maybe a spot shower north of us. Sunshine in the afternoon, strong winds, temperatures upper 70s. There'll probably be some spots down south that reach the low 80s tomorrow. And then in the evening, eyes focused southwest Iowa, potential for some of those storms to develop. Right now, Storm Prediction Center has the higher risk for severe weather just east of the Omaha metro. That yellow slight risk, Atlantic towards Shenandoah, Falls City, Maryville. Even higher chances, Des Moines and east where we have the enhanced and the moderate risk. So in the evening, we'll be watching for those storms to fire up all mode severe weather in play, winds, hail and possibility of a tornado. So need to be weather aware, especially as we head closer to sunset on Tuesday. There's a broader view. You can see the moderate risk really encompassing the same area that got slammed last Friday. So parts of the Midwest and South again under the gun with this next system that's sitting out in the Northwest right now. And yes, that is snow blizzard like conditions around the Nebraska Panhandle right now. And the backside of the system again is going to bring some impactful winter weather, but we're going to miss out on that. Here's the setup. This is Tuesday morning. So the warm front, I think, gets just past Omaha. So we get in the warm sector and get that big warm up. This is the area that has more favorable ingredients to see those severe storms. So again, just east of the Omaha Metro in the evening pushing east with the front as we go through the nighttime hours. Meanwhile, blizzard conditions in the Dakotas and Nebraska Panhandle on the backside of the system by Wednesday morning. Those northwest winds driving in some much cooler air. So impact weather, upper 70s Tuesday, highs back in the 40s Wednesday. But it's only a quick cool down. Temperatures moderate. And there we go, heading into Easter weekend. A nice stretch of spring weather, 60s on Friday, and then into the 70s Saturday and Sunday.